Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Johnny Quest. Johnny Quest. Don't, don't. Johnny Quest. 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 Johnny Johnny Quest. 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 Hello and welcome to Send Me Back Magic Sketch number 330. Uh, I know we took a week off, sorry about that, but we got some new stuff for you this week. We got a douche calling someone else a douche. We got some vlog stuff, bunch of stuff going on in the vlog. Uh, we also have this voice that you gotta hear in the video section. So in the Singularity News this week, we have Amber Crombie and Finch telling Mike the situation that he can't wear their clothes. And they would even pay him not to wear their clothes on the Jersey Shore. And in fact, they don't want anybody on the show wearing their clothing. Let's see. They deal with attractive people. Check marks. They both reek of cheap perfume. Check mark. They both like loud music. Check mark. One of these two has been accused of nearly using child porn in advertising. Way to go, Amber Crombie. What's next? Is Hooters going to tell women with large chests that they can't wear their shirts? Is Corvette going to tell balding middle-aged men that they can't drive their cars? And is Coors Light going to tell rednecks that they can't drink their beer? On August 6, 2011, at the Valley View apartment complex where I'm currently residing, um, there was a five alarm fire, which you can see now in the footage. Uh, it was it was pretty bad. We weren't home at the time. Uh, it wasn't our building. Um, our hearts and thoughts and prayers go out to those who, you know, were misplaced. No one was hurt. So anyone that's known me for any period of time knows I'm obsessed with Eastern State Penitentiary and they have a barber chair there and I've always wanted a barber chair of my own. So the other day cruising around on eBay, found this baby right here. Uh, got it for a steal. Uh, made a huge mess with the hydraulic fluid, but it's all good. So on the same day that I got my chair, Paula decided to go take a look at a dog at the Burks Animal League, I think that's what it's called. It's, a, it's an animal rescue in uh, near Reading, Pennsylvania. Um, the dog she went to see was unfortunately already adopted the day before, and but she decided since she was there, she'd take a look around because we were looking for a second dog to go along with Mason. Uh, she found this cute, uh, what they what we believe to be a chai pin, which is half Chihuahua, half Min pin. Um, we named her Murray. It's a long story. Uh, maybe the next vlog will explain the origins of the name Murray. Uh, but they're, you know, we got a new dog. Uh, she's great. Uh, they're getting along really well. They play. It's it's really cool. Um, I was a little frustrated at first, but uh, things are going well now. So. Okay, now it's time for the viral video of the week. Let's take a look at it right now. I can't even smell, I can't even do nothing. <coughs> oh, I can feel it right now in my mouth. <laughs> Wait, am I confused? Is this RuPaul's Drag Race Kids Edition? Actually, what this is, this is Toddlers and Tierras, and somebody decided to take this clip and slow it way down, and it becomes crazily funny. Uh, a couple thoughts that popped into my head while watching this is um, this is like every Waffle House waitress I've ever had. 
Uh, this show creeped me out to begin with, and now it's even creepier that she's got this voice. Uh, she reminds me of one of the women on Designing Women for some reason, I don't know. Um, and in the future, in her career, there's a good chance she'll be saying the same thing, but to a guy. Just saying. Anyway, that's all for this week on Send Me Back My Edge Sketch. I'm Johnny Quest. The email will be in the notes. Boom, right there or something. Um, hit us up. Thanks for watching. Tune in next week. Feel it right now. In the mail.